one thing that I've learned or that I find interesting actually more than I've learned um, I train people like I said mostly women and there's a fair amount of women who have self esteem struggles right and a lot of people who struggle with self esteem are some of the toughest people that you'll ever meet they just need to be pushed to go past the limit and what's great about train, train, training in sports you know if you want to tie, tie, tie it in is that you get to see where where your limits are exactly you can be doing your job at a high rate and it's actually pretty pretty average but because everyone else is kind of doing just a little bit less or maybe a little bit more it kind of all looks the same but when you're training or in a sport the result is pure so there isn't a, uh, some paperwork that I can look like I'm doing or whatever. Either you lifted that weight or you didn't. <laughs> there ain't no, is 205 on the bar, did you deadlift it or did, did you not? That's it. And I can watch you and I can look at your body and know if you're doing it. You can't cheat it. There's no way you cheat, cheat, cheat it. And people who work out and women who work, work, work out, they want to see the results. So they'll go hard as hell to see if they can push themselves to, to get the results. Now what's also interesting about that is that many times people have self-esteem issues about being successful. And what that training in sports allows you to do is be successful in some, some, something which in your mind says if I can do it in one thing I can do it in a lot of things. So it opens you up to be more confident in doing other things. So when I talk about like a health lifestyle, it's much bigger than ever the weights or, you know, any sport or anything. It's teaching yourself how to succeed independent of what other people may think. So if people think I can lift 205 in a deadlift, it doesn't matter what they think. If I know I can do it, I can do it. So it's it's an opinion independent thing. Like what, what you think I can do, it doesn't change what I can actually do. I know what I can do. So that helps them in other areas where they thought they couldn't learn something or, or they doubted themselves in a way that now they're like, wait, they're, your brain will unlock things when it sees success happen once. It'll be like, oh, this can happen in this area, this area, this area. So when people are trying to achieve and trying to be great, you often will see them that part of their life involves working out because it's trained them to do something, some, some, something extraordinary that will translate into other area, 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 areas of their life. 